go ahead and open it up simply go and tap on settings and once you open up settings I want you all to scroll down and have a look for additional settings when you go ahead and scroll down you will see a notification under here saying quick ball simply tap on that to activate it simply go and tap on turn on and now as you can see on the right hand side of my screen I've activated the little quick ball now what's nice about this quick ball is you can simply move it around to wherever you want so for example I'm just going to move it to a little bit above the screen here now what you can actually do is when you tap on it you can see there are custom notifications set to the quick ball now you can go ahead and actually change those to however you want now for instance the preferred gesture let's go ahead through the settings select shortcuts we can actually choose and move them around Prefer gesture, tap or swipe. I'm going to stick to tap. Hide automatically so the quick ball will disappear on selected apps. So for instance, if you're on WhatsApp or Facebook and you don't want the quick ball to pop up, you can actually hide it within a specific app. And move aside the full screen, show on lock screen. No, that's fine. Now, we now I want to actually show you here with one hand mode, so I'm just going to go ahead and pick up my phone. A lot of the times, getting to the top right hand corner to the bottom of this, I can't actually do a lot of things with one thumb. So with Quick Ball, this gives me access to the little ball and I can tap on the home button and my phone goes to the home button. If I go ahead and maybe tap on multitasking, I can quickly jump to the multitasking feature. So this is a great tool to help you use your phone with one hand. Now these are quite rudimental gestures. What we maybe want to do is do some custom gestures or actually custom shortcuts. So we can go ahead and home menu lock screenshot. I don't really use screenshot too much. I'm going to go and change that. I'm going to go and maybe for instance choose torch, long press down, maybe a, a selected app. Or oh, one of my favorite apps currently at the moment is of course, let's see if I can find it, Instagram, Instagram. Well, let's use WhatsApp for now. Okay, I've set WhatsApp to a custom little shortcut. So if I tap on the quick ball, you will see now the WhatsApp icon. So whenever I tap on WhatsApp, it will actually take you to the WhatsApp. We can go and change to another one or the back sign. Let's go maybe use torch. And now when I hit that button on quick ball, you can see the torch icon there. Now, ladies and gentlemen, that is a quick tutorial on how to use the quick ball function. Now, no doubt when you're especially using a Mi Max or a Redmi Note series, this will be a great feature to be using one hand. Now, for any other tips and tricks tutorials, please make sure you go into the library on our YouTube channel and see what else you can learn. Now, if you guys really thought this tutorial was a great help, make sure to hit that thumbs like button. And of course, for future Xiaomi tips and tricks tutorials, please make sure to subscribe to our channel.